Holy shit. Disclaimer before we get into this video, this is obviously a very sad topic, but I just had to speak about it. Like, this is mental. Absolutely crazy what I'm about to show you. So, in Kansas City, no surprise it's actually in America, a child has been killed after their mother puts her in the oven. Is this a joke? No. Not joking. So this happened on the 11th of February, so literally yesterday, an infant in Missouri was killed after her mother mistakenly put her down for a nap in an oven. What the hell am I reading? Now, if you're a little bit starstruck and your brain has just exploded into a gazillion jillion pieces, then I'm going to join you on that one because I have not a clue what I have just read there. I cannot believe what sort of human beings are entrusted these days and are allowed to have kids. I honestly think... If if you want a child these days, you need to have a rigorous background check. You should not just be able to pop one out. You should have, like, a condom drilled onto the end of your wiener so that you cannot receive a child until you have specific permission that you're sane enough and it can be removed from your genitals by your doctor, all right? They unscrew it or something, and then you're free to do it because we are just giving this power to anyone. I know when God, you know, gave man and women their genitals, they thought, they will not misuse these. They will treat them well. Fucking hell, no. They shag anything with a pulse these days. It's terrible. You especially. Just how do you mistakenly put down your child in an oven? Firstly, oven doors open down. You know, you actually have to open the oven door, put the child in there, shut the door, and then forget about it. Firstly, forgetting about your child is like looking after a kid 101. Always remember you have a child. Two, why an oven? Put it on the floor. Put it on the table. An oven is not a comfortable bed. I've not gone, hmm, I'll put them on the oven, or I can put them on the table, which is more comfortable. Yeah, I think the boiling hot oven oven with uh, little things that stick out. That's going to really help this child get to sleep. Absolute idiots, mate. Idiots. I it, oh, it piss. It, like I said before, you should be able to, you should have to pass a test in order to be allowed to have a child these days. They're just giving the sausage to any old. It's actually mind blowing. Announced dead at the scene, unsurprisingly, this baby was turned into a fucking kebab. Like, what the hell is wrong with this mother? Like, this mother should be done for murder. You know, you don't accidentally lie it in the middle of the road, do you? You don't accidentally hang it from a tree. You don't accidentally put your child in the chimney, do you? You know, these things just do not happen. Not to normal people who can actually think and actually comprehend things. Endangering, endangering the child's welfare. Bro, you've cooked him. This isn't an episode of MasterChef. This is uh, like a child life has been taken due to your simplest. Imagine if you were the grandparents and you go, how the f have I raised a child that does not know that if you put a child in the oven, its probability of survival is very minimal. Probably zero. I would be more annoyed at myself that I had let this child grow up his whole life, or her whole life, sorry, and thought, put Putting the child in a fucking oven is a sensible solution as to where it can have a nap. I know bedding's expensive, so I don't want to, you know, say put it in a bed because some people can't afford it, and that's horrible. I do agree. However, you've also chosen to have the child. If you do not have anywhere safe for it to sleep other than an oven, I suggest maybe hanging fire until you can. And obviously, more complicated than just saying no, I get that, but you know what I mean, mate. The poor kid is now dead due to not having, I presume, a livable and a comfortable place to live. So that's the video. So as we discussed, that uh, firstly, what a horrible, horrible story this is. A child is burnt to death because of an idiot mother putting the child down for a nap in an oven. Look, this is not a, a humorous topic at all. It's very serious and very fucking sad. I couldn't believe it when I read it. I, I thought this is a lie. This is something you click on the internet that takes you to a porn site and blows up your computer from all the way in bloody Afghanistan or something. But no, this was real. This was a real news article. 
article from a news source I trust very, very, very well. I trust them to at least not make up a complete article. The police responded to the infant not breathing because it had been cooked, and they said that the child had apparent burns and was pronounced dead at the scene. Statement says response were told by a witness the mother put the child down for a nap and accidentally, accidentally placed her in the oven instead of the crib. I mean, what sort of stuff is this lady smoking? What is in her pipe? Because no sane, normal individual is putting a baby in the oven instead of the bed or a table or a flat surface. It did not explain how this mistake was made. Yeah, well, she was actually sipping Jack Daniels and hitting the bong at the same time. And she just was like, I'll put her down here for one minute. Stood back and was like, holy shit, I'm stoned as fuck. Forgot she did it. She was like, oh, I fancy some chicken nuggets. Turned on the oven. Next thing she know, she's cooked a kid. It's fucking outrageous. This woman should be done for murder, not endangering a life. Like, endangering a life is not that. That's killing someone. You've cooked a child alive. Look, this is a very serious topic. Uh, if you don't like this sort of stuff, then why have you made it this far? But I wanted to discuss it and just honestly question how some people are able to bring a child into this world and how they've got away with it for so long. You know, people should not just be allowed to... Uh, you know, you should, I'm telling you, you need like a test. You need a written age report. You need certain things in place to stop this sort of... These idiots, these stupid people. You know, no normal sober person puts their child in the oven mistakenly. Please, show me this woman's blood reports. I want to see what she's on. Because there is not a chance. Mate, not even a stoner is putting the child down. What am I on about? The child, if you were stoned, would be like golden glass statue. So, you know, you can't put it down. You'd have to hold it forever. Oh, God. Anyway... I'm sorry for this little child had to be born in uh, such a stupid and retarded family. It's it's terrible. Look, I'm sorry. Just wanted to sort of make a video on this. It's, uh, it's a very horrible thing to think about being burnt alive. Never mind a child. And it's, never mind because it's the idiot mother's fault for forgetting she put her in a furnace. Like, Jesus. But yeah, thank you very much, guys. Uh, stay safe out there. And if you've made it to the age of 15 and your parents haven't thrown you in a fucking oven, then I think we should all go and give them a hug and thank them for having at least half a brain on their shoulders.